Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. The day is finally here that I have a custom Blythe that has arrived. Now I know what I said. I said that I wasn't going to get a Blythe until March and we're not even out of January yet and I already have a Blythe and we're very excited about that. Um, but this Blythe is from Anna Sagina and I will leave her information below. I'm just so thrilled that this doll showed up so fast because January's not even over. I bought this doll on, she only took maybe two and a half, two weeks, a week and a half to get here. She was delivered extremely fast. So very, very impressed with how fast she arrived from Russia. And I did get a Blythe that was a real base. Her base is, um, Alfresco Picnic, I think is what it's called. So anyway, I'm really, really excited about this because I have been, oh yeah, I've just been like obsessing, obsessing. So um, I just was looking at a lot of different, um, following a lot of different accounts on Instagram and doing some research and stuff. And I've actually bought another custom besides her too. So I've got, so there'll, be, there'll be two here in the house before too long, but anyway. Um, so sh let's see, I'm trying to figure out how to get into this. I'm, t I'm too excited. I'm like, like so, so excited because I did not, I really didn't expect her to arrive this quickly. Um, with the way the post here in the U.S. has been and then add an international post on top of that, it's like, um, an issue. Okay, picnic al fresco. Yeah, so she sent her in the original box. That's nice. Very nice. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, let's get her out. Ah, I'm so excited. And she does have an alpaca rerouted scalp, which is really cool. And when I ended up getting her, um, oh man, oh, she's got her full set outfit with the glasses. I love these glasses. They're so cute. She's got her stand. And she came on an obitsu body, so she's got some extra hands here and some little shoes. Oh, and I think this was a gift because I don't think this was, that's so sweet. I love that, this little like Angora feeling teddy hat. Oh, okay. Yay, 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 yay. She is tied in on the back. I love that she included the stock box. That's really nice um, just to have that. And we've got the stand and the picnic basket here already. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, I can see her little face. Look at her. Oh my goodness. Oh, she's sleeping. She's been napping for her journey here. Oh, she's so sweet. Oh my gosh. She's sweeter than you, Pimento. Oh, okay, I'm gonna take her out. Oh. How cool is that? Okay, let me, let me open her eyes. So she's got these, um, let's see, where did it go? I just saw the pull rings. Where did they go? Oh, here they are. They're really small. So she's got these, um, like these purple pull rings. How cute is that? I love that. Wow. So I'm gonna open her eyes up so we can take a look. Oh, so she's got green eyes. These are like a greenish blue. I love this hair, y'all. I love, it. it's funny because um, my friend, I sent my friend a picture and she was like, that's your twin. And I was like, you know what? I didn't realize it, but she kind of is my twin with the green eyes and like the dirty blonde hair. Let's see. Oh, those are her eyes closed. Let me, all right. Uh-oh, let me figure out how to do this. Let's see. So I've never had a custom bike. Oh, okay. Look at that. So I guess you have to do one cord and then the other. That must be what this is. So you do, I didn't know that. That's really cool. I haven't really paid attention to anybody doing that. So let's see, let me do, no, those are the closed cord, Allison. Let me, let's see. There we go. And there's this, to the side, they're like kind of blue, like more of an aqua 
blue and then I guess we close and then like close and click and then open and then there's the green eyes this is her like Allison twin look she's got like the same color hair and eyes as me this cat what is he doing oh he got his head in the back y'all this cat <laughs> what in the world Sorry, we had to take a break there because you're supposed to keep plastic bags away from animals and, and small children and animals that act like small children. But anyway, so this is her like my twin look. She's got green eyes and she's got this dirty blonde hair like I have. And she's really gorgeous. She's got like her nostrils are actual holes. So she's got actual holes for nostrils, which I think is cool. This is the first custom life I've ever seen in person. So I don't know, like I have no frame of reference for this, but I absolutely adore her. I love the face up that the artist did on her. Um, wow, she's just so gorgeous. And I love the eye chips that she put in. They're very like realistic and fun. Now, somebody had told me that I might not like the OB body because, or no, I might not like the neck tilting capability because the, the heads wobble, but I've kind of been playing with it and it's not wobbly at all. So it actually, like I kind of like that neck tilting ability so I can have her looking in different directions and tilting her head to show some emotion and things like that. And then the body's a little squeaky, but that's probably because it's a new body and it'll take some time. So I'm like super pumped about her. She's so, so, so cute. Like really cute and I love this hair. So the hair was a reroute done by, I can't remember the name, but I'll link it below as well so you guys can check that out. But that's gorgeous, like, long alpaca like really long so that's really cool i love that that's really gorgeous and then i like the i've seen some of the custom um like the custom pulls that have really huge beads and chains on them i'm glad this one doesn't because i feel like that would be a little bit awkward so i'm just i'm trying to learn about the eye closing so you close and click but then you have to reopen the eyes so that's how that works so close and click and then reopen the eyes so that's why you got the two strings i had wondered how that worked i had wondered how the close drawstring closed the eyes and they didn't pop back open and she's got beautiful full lashes just look at the shading on her on her um eyelids and then those gorgeous full lashes oh she's amazing you know what the cat's probably so interested in this because this is alpaca and he's very interested in natural fibers oh she is so sweet she really is my twin <laughs> like you can't see all my freckles because I'm wearing makeup, but I do have quite a bit of freckles on my face, especially in the summertime. You can see them very prominently. Oh, y'all, she's so cute. I love her. I love her, love her, love her. And I love that she's got this jointed body because I'm going to have fun with that. Oh, did you see that? And she's got panties on for all y'all that care. I, <laughs> that's been really funny to me is all the people interested in the doll panties so she does have some panties on so that's good um oh she her little body's coming apart i think that's how those ob bodies are they i've i've had she did come apart let's see she gotta put her back together it shouldn't be too hard you would think i've done this before oh i might have to undress her for that but anyway, y'all, I think she's just so super cute. I'm like really, really excited to add one to my collection. I would say finally add one to my collection, but I've really only been obsessing about her since about a custom Blythe since the beginning of January. And the fact that I was supposed to wait until March and I totally, you know what? I'll actually tell you the story. This is, this is legit how the story went. I woke up and I read my horoscope that morning because as one does, I like to read my horoscope in the morning. Whether you believe in that stuff or not, it's fun to read because sometimes it gives you a really positive message. So I got up and I read my horoscope that morning and it said, I'm trying to remember the exact wording, but it said, don't put off that big purchase you've been looking at any longer. Today's the day to buy or something like that. And so I told my husband, I was like, look at what my horoscope says today. And he was like, well, just go ahead and buy a Blythe then. And that's exactly how it happened. So there, there she is. And oh my gosh, I love her. I love her. 
That is so cool, y'all. That is so cool. I really, really adore her so much. And now I have all the cute accessories too that went with her full set. So I love that because, um, you know, I probably won't dress her in this often, even though it's really super cute. But I'm so, I have already bought, I can't even tell y'all how many Blythe clothes I've already bought. My Blythe dolls are gonna be so spoiled. Y'all, she's so gorgeous. Absolutely so gorgeous. So pleased with her. So much fun. So anyway, um, and she got here so fast. Like I keep saying that, but from Russia to here in two weeks or maybe less than, that's amazing, especially considering, like I said, everything that's kind of been going on lately with shipping and whatnot. So I'm just really, really thrilled about that. I'm gonna put her little shirt on while we're, while we're just sitting here talking. But yeah, she's, she, I mean, she got here so fast, like really happy about it. And I've been having a lot of fun learning about Blythe and looking at different artists and things like that. So this has been a fun learning experience for me. And so I got my other custom coming and then probably my next, um, my next thing will be to get a vintage, um, one of the vintage Kenner Blythes. And what I, my, my hope is to get one, and I don't know if this is even in the realm of possibility, for under 500 bucks, but maybe one that needs a lot of work, because I think it'll be really fun to restore an old Blythe, because I always have loved restoring old dolls. So, oh look, oh, I love her, I love her, love her. And the artist did sign the back of her neck. So there's the signature. So I'm like really, really pumped about this. I love this doll. I'm really happy that I got her. I'm really happy with my first custom life. She's so gorgeous. And she has like all the cool little things that I was hoping for. She has, you know, the, the natural hair, like the alpaca hair. She's got really gorgeous natural eye chips. She's got freckles, which I wanted. And she's got the OB, uh, I think it's the OB24. It's either 22 or 24, I can't remember. The OB body, which is, is really fun for me because coming from a place where I collect a lot of BJDs, um, I like posability, but to be honest, I've been having so much fun with my Disco Boogie Blythe, who's just on her original body lately, that honestly, the body's not as big of a deal to me as I originally thought it might be. Oh my gosh, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna shut up now, but guys, if you made it this far and listened to me rant and ramble and watch the cat stick his head in the plastic bag, I just wanna say thank you so much. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you are not subscribed, please subscribe because there's going to be more Blythe content coming because I can't stop myself. So um, guys, thank you again and we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.